Damn it! I just recorded a video and it didn't record. <laughs> Fucking bullshit. Whatever, we're starting off like this. I don't care if you see my desktop. Let's pull this up. There's a little bit of a different start for you since I just did a fucking 15 minute video and it didn't record. There you go, folks. It happens sometimes. When you press the hot key to record an OBS, it doesn't record. So I'm gonna hit that manually right there. There you go, folks. Today, let's talk about Red Pill not just being for MGTOW. Let's talk about it. Like, cause the people that are new to all this, they're like, oh, they just associate that with MGTOW. They associate the red pill with MGTOW, but it's for much more than that. It's for all sorts of things. It's for these narratives and agendas that you see being pushed on society. And it's for all that. Okay, I have to re-sum up the video that I just perfectly did. Damn it. So, step one. You're seeing... So you're, let's just say you're just learning about the red pill and in the MGTOW. I call it just being conscious. You're conscious and you're knowing of things that are actually happening around you. You're using your mind. People don't want you to use your mind nowadays. They want you to be a dumb little sheep that's just like, oh, 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 man, let me pay attention to this. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, high school, they told me shit. They left stuff out of the history books. I don't care. I don't care if they're just fitting narratives and trying to get people to go down our path and our narrow thought fucking patterns. I don't care at all. Whee! And, like, you're realizing all this. It's, it's more than that. Red pill, conscious, whatever you want to call it. Not woke. Woke. That's some dumb bullshit that people say on the internet. Oh, white people. White people. Evil and you damn it. Oh, I'm woke. Oh, I'm woke. Fuck all that. Okay? It's really the media. At the end of the day, it's really the media trying to, like I said, push their narratives and agendas on people and get people thinking a certain emotional way about certain things. Also to divide people and then maybe one day they'll be fighting out in the streets. Maybe they'll fight out in the streets and we'll get some ratings to our dumb bullshit. And I'm talking about all, all these media places, all these media outlets, they all got their own spin. They put their own spin on everything. And it's just, can we just get someone that's just saying pure facts? Can, can there be a news outlet that says pure facts? Like, here's the story. Here's our, we're not going to spin it to make this person look like a god. We're not going to spin it to make this person look evil. We're not going to spin it and spin it and leave out this and leave out that and maybe trim the video up here. <laughs> I mean, you see this happen all the time. I could give you countless, countless examples of this. And all these media outlets do it. Like, let's just say recently, the kid with the freaking... The guy comes over there beating the drum. When you see the full video, it's they're not being disrespectful at all. But they see something, and then they're like, oh, man, I got to jump on that. He's wearing that red hat with those words on it. Oh, my God. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Ah. You see that, and you're just like, I, I, I can't take these people serious. I can't. I'm not going to buy into anything they say because all they're doing is just spinning stuff all damn day. So the red pill is for that as well. I mean, like you already know, it's for the relationships and the mind games of just people in general. Not even just, not even just that. All the time, people try to play mind games. Especially nowadays, with the phones and the texting. And, oh, we gotta text it this time, or that time, or you can't respond then, or you'll seem that way. You can't say this, or say that. It's just, it's a lump sum of things. It is a lump sum of things. That you just realize in real time, this is stupid. That's stupid. It's not hating everything. It's you're realizing, oh, this is dumb. Just because society thinks that this is the most accepted thing, society thinks this is how what I should do or where I should go or how I should look or how I should act because of how I look, all of this, all of this could be into the red pill mindset. And not many people want to talk about that. They just want to attach it to a certain thing. Say, oh, red pill, big toe, red pill, this, red pill, that. Whoa, 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 whoa. You know, stuff like that. There was so much more that I said in the first video. You know, I just, I don't write a script. 
I'm not one of these fake people that's like, oh, let me write out the big script so I can sound ultra fucking fake and da 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 da. No, I'm a real person saying real things. That's what I am. I know that's a dying breed. I know common sense is a dying breed. Like it's even like some people consider themselves red pill nowadays if they just have a little bit of common sense, because that's dead. People are offended by everything. They want to police jokes. They want to police people's thoughts. They're going to eventually be able to do that. I'm not saying in our lifetime, but they're going to be able to literally read inside your head what you are thinking. What you are thinking. And you won't be able to think a certain way or you'll be put in jail for thinking a certain way. That's the path we are going down as a society right now. That's where we're going to end up when that technology is invented. Because the route of, oh, I can't even take some jokes from, uh, uh, oh no, the comedian's hurting my feelings. He needs to be censored. Ah. It's these people that were bullied and they never stood up for themselves. It's these people, and you're, you're giving these people too much ground to stand on. People that apologize when they don't do anything wrong. People that just, that just flow along. They just flow right along. They don't real. They're blissfully ignorant people. Blissfully ignorant people that don't think. Blissfully ignorant people that just go with the flow. Blissfully ignorant people that just do mundane tasks every day. Kiss their boss's ass. People that just do all of this are stupid. It's as simple as that. It's blissful ignorance. Religion. Blissful ignorance. Bliss, you're blissfully ignorant to facts. I'm not talking about the theories. I'm talking blissfully ignorant to facts. You're blissfully ignorant to the fact that, oh, this right here contradicts this other part in the same book. Multiple times. Oh, wait, this? Oh, wait, no, I'm going to ignore that part because that's not socially accepted nowadays. Let me just ignore that part in this. No, it's just, it's all dumb shit. I already made a video about that. But, <sighs> feel like I'm beating a dead horse at this point because I already is I'm making this video two times because this bullshit didn't work but there you go folks this one was less time because I freaking whatever there you go hopefully you enjoyed I got all kinds of content coming hopefully to record the first time so you get the best video out of it but there you go have a great day have a great life peace oh yeah watch other videos decide if you want to subscribe Hit, hit the bell, because you need to do that nowadays to get a 60% chance that you might see my video. Or actually 40%. There you go. Peace.